Hey, it's me, Bad B. I'm back. Okay, so we were in Paris and then we went to Belgium where we went to Brussels and then Bruges, which was amazing. And then we took the Eurostar to Amsterdam because we were flying out of Amsterdam. Now, I'm not sure if you've seen Eurotrip, but you know that Miss Scoozy guy? I'll find a clip. Miss Scoozy. Anyway, so that's just what I kept thinking. We had our suitcases and everything and we got a ticket. It was first class again, which was great. It was a little compartment that was just my husband and I. And it was a really short train ride actually we were only in Amsterdam for a couple of hours because we had to get to the airport so we just walked around walked around the station put our luggage in the lockers which was really convenient everything smelt like weed which I'm not a huge fan of and my husband was right around the station it's just dingy kind of dirty and ugh. so the same goes for Amsterdam but I mean it's not just a Europe thing same in Melbourne, same in Japan. Not so much Japan, I guess. I didn't wear my wig because I was going on a plane, so I was super self-conscious. I guess it just looks like I have short hair now. <laughs> Lots of places with cheese, chocolate and waffles. We went to this cafe that was kind of hip, and I think it was on the edge of the red light district. I got a matcha and my husband got a coffee the girls were just coughing and it was kind of gross and packed and there were all these little flies everywhere which was gross oh what i don't like about europe is you have to pay to go to the toilet or buy something which i'm totally fine with but the toilets are always gross we were in the red light district and it was daytime so we didn't really see anything dodgy no walks of shame it was about 10 a.m after walking around we were like oh yeah I got a hot chocolate, my husband got, did he get a coffee? I think he got a coffee. Then after that, we took the train to the airport. Again, we had our own little individual compartment. It was really quick and easy, nice and cheap. My husband's like, let's do Uber. I'm like, no, it's like way cheaper to take the train and our luggage is already in the station. It just makes sense. Then we checked in, apparently, is it Schiphol or Schiphol Airport? Anyway, Amsterdam Airport. It's meant to be one of the worst airports, but it's connected to the train station, which is convenient. We checked in really quickly. We got to go to the airport lounge, which was really nice. I think it was, it's not the KLM one. I had lots of dips and stuff, it was good. We flew back to Doha, but it was a really good trip. Pretty tiring, to be honest. I loved Paris, loved Bruges. Brussels is meh, Amsterdam was kind of meh, but I'm glad I went to all of them. It was three hours in Amsterdam, <laughs> not even. I've been to a few countries in Europe now. I think Italy and France are probably still my favorite. Stay tuned for more travel things.